Welcome to Orlando's signature golf event, the Arnold Palmer Invitational. First golf event ever. I'm so excited. Hey there, everyone, and welcome to Bay Hill, the Arnold Palmer Invitational, my very first golf event ever. I am so excited to be here in the chair today because uh, I gotta keep doing that, but I am so, so happy to be here. I'm gonna take a picture in front of this right now. It starts off here with the photos. Let me head on in here to the tournament entrance and uh, check out maybe some merchandise. This is one of several shops for the uh, Arnold Palmer. You know I'll be getting some uh, special items here. I don't know what it's gonna be, but gotta get something to signify my first pro golf event ever that I've ever been to. Gotta get something. Here's a really cool hat. There's so much cool merchandise. $40 just to give you an example. I was looking at this hat. I have a marker with me, so I was thinking about getting a few signatures. Maybe uh, Rory will be around here, do some signing, but in the chair, it might be hard to, to do that. We'll see, I'm not sure yet. It's uh. I'm debating it. Check out the wall of hats here. They got some great ones. I, I gotta get something. Some kind of hat. I'll figure it out. As I walk now headed towards the other pro shop. This is 18. We're gonna be experiencing this all today. It's gonna be a spectacular day. Oh my gosh. Just excited to be here, be a part of it. JK was just pointing out the fact that there's just nothing on these courses. It's just pristine. It's barely even like a leaf out there. It's just like, it's, it's pure, the entire thing. But I'm very excited to, uh, see those holes start to appear. There you go, there's a tee box, scorecard behind them, and imagine living in one of these houses. Jeez, I can only imagine. Oh wait, oh, they set up their own little grandstand. Jeez, this is perfect. Oh my gosh, can you imagine living here for this event? Just sit back, relax, and enjoy. That's cool. This is hole number 17? 18. 18, oh, this is the end. Mm -hmm. Wow, there's a MasterCard symbol. It's presented by MasterCard. Ooh, okay, we're going grass rolling. Dun, dun, dun. I haven't tried the scooter too much in the grass, but it seems to be working. Wow, that's so cool. That is so, so cool. I got cart access. I'm supposed to go that way, right? No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> Different kind of cart. Here we go. Oh, wow. Okay, practice area. Good to know. Maybe uh, we'll meet some legends. So the 10th here. Oh, 10th. Okay. Very cool. This is not the Arnold Palmer. This is just the uh, pro shop, but they do have a lot of cool merchandise in here. We're gonna check out some of it as we walk through. Here's another hat right here. It's actually got little uh, openings in it right there for when you're golfing. This one is $30, just standard Bay Hill merchandise. Here's a practice area. You see some of those pros getting ready to uh, try their hand at the Arnold Palmer to win. And actually I saw the trophies over here being guarded by uh, some of the, looks like either Navy or Marine cadets. Let's take a look. Here they are. Here are the, uh, Different cut, yeah. The claret jug from the open. We are here for the Arnold Palmer. Yep, those are marine cadets, as far as I can tell. That is great to see the kid autograph zone. That is so so nice. Awesome. And they got uh, food areas and different viewing area. That was it's a pretty good chip or pitch. Honestly, don't know the difference, but learning really amazing to watch. They actually, all have their own uh, little name tags here. For, uh, for where they are, and I want to do that. There's Jason Day right there. Definitely a big contender. Has the uh, opportunity to make it really far. Definitely one uh, in the past. All right, well, this is hole number nine here. Really, uh, really beautiful day. You got the guards making sure that everything stays pristine where the players get out there. Probably got another two hours or so before the players get here. This is working pretty well in the grass, so that's helpful. But uh, you can, there's a skybox up here, and yeah, it's a great day for this. There's the uh, concession stand right here. There's a Duke Energy uh, little booth here. That's, that's kind of interesting. You gotta do it. Jake's gonna go up and get some, see if he can win some Pro V1s at the Swing Center. All right, Jake's gonna give the uh, swing analysis machine a try here. Oh, wow, so we're actually looking at like a dual view of Jake. I see he's uh, swinging right here, and the camera's like watching. There we go. It's hammer time. That's an amazing shot. So as you go around, you can see there's different uh, tables. I'm guessing this is where the pros enter? I don't know. You got the boats, Paradise Grill. All right, maybe we'll stop by Paradise Grill. That sounds delicious. Family Care Center, little booths over there, Michelob Ultra booth. We're just making our way around. Check it out. We got a uh, car company here. Looks like, oh yeah, they actually have the Hummer EV. Oh, wait a minute. That I actually do want to see. Let me just go over here real quick. They have the Hummer EV. You know, more of a more of a more interested in Tesla, but they've got all the other cars for GMC. But yep, there's the Hummer EV. 
Definitely looks cool. Wow. Got to be really quiet now because the first group just teed off. We're gonna watch this group from right here. I can't wait. Now this is hole number nine. This is the track van back there. It's used to track it for when you're watching it on TV. So we're gonna actually get a front row seat as we watch uh, the players move to this uh, this hole right here. Look what we just saw right here on hole number eight. It's a uh, Russell Henley. It's nice that they have the names right there. Oh my gosh. Wow. This is hill number eight, and there's a ball that was just landed right here. So we're gonna we're gonna watch as the talent she comes out. We see how this uh, ball plays out. Oh my gosh, that was far. So we finally were able to find one of these uh, sheets that tells us where the uh, different players are at any given time. So the best players should be right over there. There's Jordan Spieth right down there. Yep, it's going to be cool. So first uh, meal of the day is uh, kind of a late lunch, cheeseburger. And we're near the landing zone on number six. So we'll see a couple of them come in. It's going to be fun. This is the hole we've been looking at quite a bit. Hole number six, 555 yards. Good luck making that across. That's a, that's a really tough hole. Makes that big C circle going all the way around. So impressive. Yeah, great ball. Great ball. Wow. All right, so now Jason Day is coming down. We're gonna watch him play here on hole number six. We got waters, chips, and cookies. Better price than concession stands. And then over here, they're actually, I'm not sure if this house belongs to the owner or what, but they're they're hiring for, for it looks like a solar company. crowd where Rory McElroy's people come and watch him, including yours truly. He's uh, definitely one of the top players. tell you, doing the uh, Arnold Palmer and a scooter, they, they definitely make it all accessible, no question about it. It is difficult to navigate the crowd sometimes, and you gotta have one that works on the grass, for sure. Thankfully, this one does. But, uh, tons of fun. A lot of things, you, you gotta be into golf, though. Gotta be into all of it, in order to enjoy it. And luckily, I am. A full swing documentary. Even these small putts can be really difficult. Pros have trouble making that. 
I mean, that just makes me feel better as an as a true, true amateur. You know. Here we are in the other official merchandise area. They've got flags, hats, shirts. Oh my gosh, I don't know. I need a hat or a shirt. My first PGA event ever. I need one of the two. Okay, I think I found uh, one of my favorites. 109 for this one. But I really like that shirt. I'm debating it. It's a debate here. I don't know. Okay, I've seen a lot. I'm going to keep on waiting before we uh, end up getting something. Dive bombing something. Oh, you got a fish. Woo! Got a fish. And now he's going to display his catch for us all to see. Wow, that's impressive. Go, go, go. Oh. Ooh, oh, oh. oh my gosh, I don't know what happened. In the rocks. It's in the rocks. Sure enough, got a shirt right there. Check this one out. That is so, so nice. A nice golf shirt. You'll see me wearing it at some point. Love it. Got a little gift. For lunch today, we've got those chicken tacos. Look really good as we're looking on hole 18. And Jake's got the pulled pork. The pulled yeah, pork. Pulled yep. pork. Looks really mm -hmm. good. 18 right here. Continues all the way over there. Great view as we enjoy our lunch. Tacos are not bad at all. Um, chicken itself, or the beef, or I don't know, pork, I don't know what it is. It's really good. Needs more of the salsa for sure, a bit more sauce. I mean, obviously, they're not going for the, you know, five diamond award for food here, but uh, still pretty good for, um, you know, sideline food. Made it to the grandstand now of 17. You can see the uh, hole is right here for 17. As we start to wrap up the day here, really fantastic time at Arnold Palmer. So glad I came. So much fun hanging out with my buddy Jake. Really having a great time. We just got some towels to cool off. It's a very hot one, but such a fun experience. I could definitely recommend Arnold Palmer and other uh, pro golf events. I will definitely be back in the future. So cool. You can see they're doing uh, makeup there for someone doing an interview shortly. There's a lot of this we're seeing all over. But such a, such a fun experience. Love the whole thing. I will leave you with the quote of the day. You must play boldly to win. Arnold Palmer. Thanks so much, everybody. Have a truly magical day, and I'll see you real soon.